guys welcome back to my youtube channel so i thought i'd vlog today it's currently boxing day so i hope you all had a great christmas we didn't do much we just relaxed and stayed at home but yeah it was really nice it was just a nice relaxing day also we had a roast dinner yeah you cooked a roast dinner didn't you babe and the kids are in the backpack. Hi! Hey. Subscribe to my mummy's channel because <laughs> she's awesome. <laughs> it was nice, it was a bit of a cooler day yesterday. Yeah, it was. And it and is cool today. It, was, it wasn't as hot as it has been in Queensland, so yep. we were able to get some cooler weather. So we enjoyed having a nice hot roast. Yeah. Yeah, so it was a, a bit of a cooler day yesterday and it was it's quite overcast today too so that's a good sign that it's hopefully rain because if you're not from Australia, you're watching this and you're not from Australia, obviously we've been suffering really badly from this heat and um, these bushfires have been really bad. So it, pretty much almost every Australian has been like, you know, right, right. begging mother nature to give us rain like you know so it's definitely something that we all want here in Australia and need no. but yeah so we're off today we're going to um, uh, event cinemas and we're going to go take the kids to see the Adams family because that's pretty much all that you know all that's pretty much on that we kind of want to see you know at the moment so yeah so we're going to take the kids to see that because we also got a event cinema gift voucher from my mum for Christmas, my mum and dad, so yeah. So anyway, I hope you're all doing well and yeah, I'll check in later. And I forgot to mention too that I am almost 25 weeks pregnant, so I'll be 25 weeks in a couple of days. That's just gone so fast but at the same time it's definitely been the hardest pregnancy out of all three it's definitely been the hardest pregnancy without question um, I'm currently kind of I feel like I'm kind of back to square one like with the first trimester but I just don't have the constant nausea so I'm vomiting stomach bile again and that's because I had the my gallbladder removed so that's probably not great but um I mean it's good that I got it removed but it's just it's not pleasant vomiting that stomach acid it sucks and it's really not nice at all it makes your stomach hurt and it's just, it just tastes disgusting yeah so that's kind of not fun but you know I've only got like 14 weeks left this is my little bump here. Excuse the nails. I have to take them off and I haven't had them done yet, so. But, yeah. Hold on, darling. My little bump. So, yeah, my little baby bump. I don't know what we were, I don't know what we were thinking. We must be bloody crazy, but it has taken us so long to even get into the turning lane to go to the shops for Garden City and there's people like freaking walking from the other car park like which is like down there which is far way down there and it's like belongs to these offices or whatever but yeah so I'm gonna re we really rely on the park car parking angel today to find us a bloody car park because I don't know what we were thinking coming to the shops on Boxing Day. Like, no, must have <laughs> must have bloody rocks in our head. We thought, oh, we'll just get out of the house, take the kids out of the house. They need some time to, you know, whatever, have some family time. No, must just bloody have rocks in our head. Anyway, and we could only come to this. Uh, shopping center event cinemas because the one closest to us is not showing the Adams family, which is the movie that we're seeing. So, we have to come here. No breakfast. <sighs> and hubby's complaining because 
no breakfast, Why no car park. He hasn't had breakfast and it's like I'm hungry. He's almost quarter past hungry. 11. <clears throat> but I think we're going to have to see the later session because there's no way we're going to make it in 15 minutes. No way. Absolutely no freaking way. Me too. So yes. Look how many people are walking into the shop. I know. Hey, check it out. I'll show you. Look at them all. Oh, is that flip? There's on the reverse side. Oh, no. Oh, no. Let's go buy some groceries. And they're like, let's go to the Boxing Day sales. Everybody's honing in. They're like, keen as. Keen as mustard. That was this guy <laughs> turned, on the, turned on a red arrow. <laughs> oh my gosh, seriously. It is like jam packed. Don't do that again. Yep, and my wife has gotten rocks in her head because she reckons, yeah, 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 we'll be fine, we'll find a path. Daddy has, Daddy has rocks in his head. You know, I'm pregnant and all, okay? Mm -hmm. I, I'm, I'm not. Oh, where's the pregnancy car park? I'm not thinking clearly. There's right. a pregnancy car park for all the pregnant women that don't want to walk? Yeah, no, apparently. No. They, should have, they should have pregnancy car parks. You know? They should have pregnancy car parks. Not just baby car parks and senior car parks they need daddy, bloody pregnancy car parks because daddy it can be bloody hard to walk Mommy, daddy. long distances when you're carrying it when you're baby. carrying a bloody human in your Mom. body yes is there another is there another entrance to the yes place? there is where is it around the other side hi mommy yeah crown broke so i gave him mine Oh, that was very nice of you, Sha. I wonder why it broke. It doesn't matter. I mean... Why did it break? Did you break it? I was holding on to it and then Sha was holding it on to it and then snap. Yep. Mm. So I just needed more. Well, that was nice of you, even if you did kind of break his. But it doesn't matter because next Christmas I can get a... Uh-huh, okay. Even though I have to wait 2,800 200 years, like crazy. Are you eating steak, Dexton? It's good, mate. Charlotte, what do you have? I got chicken, chicken nuggets and curly fries. Curly fries. Yep. We haven't gotten our meal just yet. <laughs> we got our food. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Happy husband, happy life. Having some veggies. Yep. Yummy food. Start. Out of you. 
Charlie, stop eating the popcorn. Stop eating the popcorn. It's him. It's not him. <laughs> Oi. It's a very small snack. Yeah, because we're in the, like. I think in gold classes they have better quality seats and bigger movies. Bigger movie spaces. And better fruit rest. Okay. <laughs> movie. Oh, nice and relaxed now. After a nice lunch. Yep, we went to Hog's Breath, didn't we? Pretty much Mommy. to a free movie. Yep, thanks to my mum because of the gift vouchers. Yes, Daxton. Can I kind of wander around the movie? Until no, that's not right. Why? Because you have ants in your pants and you can't sit still. The top You're almost 10 years old, mate. Me too. I want to wander around no. the top Me too. No. You're not allowed to. So, we didn't spend... Kids don't play, listen to me. We didn't spend don't any money on the movies. No, we didn't. But we haven't... To spend money on lunch. But yep. We, so we got the movies for Christmas gift. Take your kids to the movies. Yep, and Troy's um, got McDonald's frozen. Instead of paying thirty dollars. Thirty dollars. The high price for the movie. For frozen drink when for the candy McDon bar. When McDonald's frozen is a dollar. So we paid forty. It's a big difference. We paid oh, four dollars. <laughs> and we're at the movies. Yep. Yeah, but, we, but we had an expensive lunch. Yeah, we did. But at least we got free, basically free movie. So instead of paying for the movie. And the expensive candy bar. Mm. We're always looking for. We got to have a really nice program. lunch that we paid for. I got pretty much a free movie, but a four dollar movie. Yep, yeah, that's right. All right, movie starting. Movie starting now. Hey guys, so we're home now. Um, been home. Been home for a couple of hours, and we've just all been chilling. Troy is watching TV. I was just doing some stuff on my laptop and watching some YouTube and the kids are just playing and yeah pretty much <clears throat> I pretty much did have plans today to try and do some cleaning but that didn't go ahead and the house looks like <clears throat> the house looks like a tornado a bomb full of shit exploded all over my house um, but that's you know what that's okay that is okay because it's Boxing Day and Christmas was only yesterday, so you know, you gotta pick your battles. And literally, the only mess that we have been cleaning when I say we, I mean Troy, because he's been cleaning the kitchen and he just did so nicely for me so I can cook dinner. Literally, the only cleaning that we have done over the last couple of days has been cleaning the kitchen so we can make more food basically <laughs> um, but yeah so I still have what is it today's Thursday today's Thursday so I go back to work on Monday um, because I had two weeks off to recover from my gallbladder surgery that I had so I go back on Monday and got like I've got the worst indigestion and I just had a quick e tablet too but just <clears throat> oh, it's like a symptom from pregnancy that I really despise really really despise is heartburn indigestion crap freaking <laughs> I freaking hate it I think most if not all pregnant women that get that do hate it so I'm not I know I'm not alone um, <clears throat> yeah yeah so we're just gonna have a chill night and probably go to bed early although I say early but I get to a certain point of the night where I just have like I just have I just get restless and I have insomnia so I find it difficult to go to sleep early and I just can't shut off and it doesn't mean it, it, it doesn't make seem to make difference whether I have a nap 
or I don't have a nap or I've been on the go all day or I haven't been on the go all day or I don't use my phone or I use my phone it doesn't matter it's just I've just got insomnia and I can't seem to go to sleep early which is fine so I don't know how I'm gonna go after the summer school holidays end and I have to get up and take the kids just to school like I don't know how I'm gonna go getting up early but I'm sure I'll manage I'm sure I'll manage so yeah so Troy had a week off this week over Christmas so he goes back to work on Monday as well and um, we've made a lot of progress with our house but we've got we have got a lot of stuff to do because hopefully um, in the next couple of weeks we're actually getting some overseas students through uh, through a university who's like <sighs> it's like a homestay thing so we actually had Japanese students um, come stay with us we had a few actually come stay with us when we were growing up and we were teenagers my sister and I and the boys my brothers my two younger brothers were only really young and yeah we really enjoyed it it was exciting it was just something different and yeah it was really interesting and it was just so interesting seeing the you know someone that's not in your family stay with you and a different culture and background and all that so um, I think it'll be good for the kids and it's just obviously they pay you like you get paid to have the students um, and there's short term and long term and that can really like um, it's it's also tax free as well in Australia in Queensland it's tax free money so obviously that doesn't contribute to an income or anything but it's still money that you get and get paid fortnightly and it's tax free money so you know that's pretty damn good um, and you just gotta obviously provide them with a ro their room a room um, a room and provide them with meals and stuff but it's not a big deal when you're feeding you know kids already so if we get our blue card back in time we will be getting two um, oh, I can't remember Taiwanese I think it was two Taiwanese girls a nine-year-old and a ten-year-old and they can both sleep in the same room as long as they have separate beds they can sleep in the same room um, so yeah so if we have if if our blue card comes back in time then we'll be getting the girls in a couple of weeks time and and they stay for a few weeks and then when they go we get a 16 year old Japanese boy um, and he stays with us for like a month all um, over February so yeah it's being really interesting but I'm not doing it by myself I'll be doing it with my sister like sh she'll be having her students as well around similar ages to ours at her house so we kind of feel like it's good because we can do it together and share the experience together and everything and then also take them out on you know a little weekend at and also take them out on like weekend outings and stuff like that so yeah so I'm probably gonna vlog again tomorrow um, but yeah tomorrow will literally be a cleaning and sorting day because because we have what Friday Saturday Sunday we have basically have three days three days before Troy and I go back to work to get our shit done so and there's a lot of shit that needs to be done so yes so <clears throat> I need to go and cook dinner now Daxon's peeling potatoes for me, aren't you, buddy? Hey? Hey? We just had dinner. Um, we just sat down and we had dinner. We just had dinner and sat at the table and had dinner and we did our high and, and we did our high and low. So each... Love you too. 
So each one of us goes around the table and has says our best part of the day and our worst part of the day. And that's called high and low. And we went around the table and we did that. And we're really trying to really gonna try and make it our mission this year to eat at the table as often as possible. And yeah, so dinner's finished and um I'm just gonna finish cleaning up and then yeah, the kids are gonna have a bath now and then I'm gonna try and have an early night as best as we can. But anyway, I will say goodbye and end the vlog now. Um <clears throat> like I said, I will try and vlog tomorrow as well. And yeah, until then I will see you later. Thanks for watching guys. Bye!